When I was young and trained to, to do this kind of work, the idea was that you know you weed eat down to the edge of the stream and that was a detriment to water quality. And so now we are mowing just what you see in the yard and then leaving the rest of this natural. One of the big things that we sort of believe in with respect to the farm and these practices is measuring if you know, they're actually doing something on the landscape. So uh, Dr. Maravich from Juniac College and his students are here uh, basically sampling um, and looking for abundance of uh, specific fish species, so finding trout and all, uh, sunfish. We lined this entire uh, Emma's Creek with hemlock logs on both sides of the stream, creating habitat and then those water features where the water ripples over these uh, logs and you can see the water clarity which is you know really fine. When I grew up here um, I would spend time fishing uh, with like my grandpa with my grandmother and the only thing we would catch here would be uh, just chubs so chubs are sort of like these you know like fat fish that you can't eat or do anything with them and they're actually a poor indicator of, uh, of water quality. Um, and now with uh, a lot of this fish structure and fish habitat, we're pulling trout out um, on a pretty regular basis, which is pretty cool. You know, you get the improved um, aquatic organisms and diversity, and that means that it's working. <laughs>